Hello Internet, this Zotac came in for repair, and according to the sticker, it looks like it's a 3080 Ti Trinity. It also looks like it has an IO shield that's bent, so we're gonna bend that back, just like so, and that should conclude this repair. Before I plug this thing in to test for a picture, let's check for some basics that anyone can do without even taking it apart. 12 volt at the slot and at the PCI Express connector shows no sign of a short. Just behind the cover I can reach for a capacitor filtering memory rail. At the top we have PEX, at the bottom right we have 5 volt and 1.8 on the left. Now let's power it on and see what it does. Looks like we can safely plug this thing into a computer and see if it produces an image. No image today, so let's try to run a memory test and see what it says. Mod's report shows third channel with error 8, so looks like we have a memory issue here. So let's take it apart and see. So what is third channel and what does number 8 mean? Well, according to my cheat sheet, third channel is C, and the number 8 means the first chip of that channel. In other words, it's a C1, as shown here, so this is the chip we need to replace, and hopefully it works. Okay, chip is replaced, resistances are good, voltage is good, so let's power it on and see what it does. And hey, we have a picture. Success! With that done, let's super clean the core, put everything back together and run a number of tests to make sure that everything is good. And just like that, we managed to save this 3080 Ti from a landfill. And hopefully at this time it is back with its rightful owner, allowing them to watch this repair video and clicking the like button. Goodbye.